Hi, I'm Tim Tyler, and this is a review of this book, Cheating Monkeys and Citizen Bees, The Nature of Cooperation in Animals and Humans, by Lee Degetkin. The book attempts to use lessons from animal ethology to help to understand why humans cooperate. It then offers advice about how to increase human cooperation based on the relevant science. This advice is not too bad. The book was published in 1999. It's quite good and well written, but it's inferior to other later books by the same author on this topic. The book classifies cooperation into kin selection, reciprocity, byproduct mutualism and group selection. Since reciprocity is a type of byproduct mutualism, this seems to be a rather curious categorization. Also, group selection and kin selection have turned out to make the same set of predictions, and so a classification scheme that divides them no longer makes very much sense. Of course, this issue is a lot clearer now than it was back when this book was written. One thing this, that this book is missing is much about cultural transmission. Culture is important to why humans cooperate. However, this book only mentions culture in a couple of paragraphs. Doug Atkins' next popular book was all about the significance of cultural transmission. I think he must have had quite a revelation on the topic between 1999 and 2001. This book ends with three pages about reconciling science and religion, which frankly I could have done without. The book is readable, but not revolutionary. Not Doug Atkins' finest work. Enjoy.